Well, things are already getting heated off the ring ahead of one of the biggest fights Thanksgiving weekend. Jamal Charlo, the two weight division world champion, returns to the ring. Fox 26's Coco Dominguez spoke exclusively with Jamal as he gets ready for the spotlight in Vegas. Coco Dominguez here at the Ronnie Shields Boxing Gym where Missouri City Zone Jamal Charlo is making a comeback two and a half years the WBC middleweight champion of the world this is his last sparring session before the big fight November 25th on a showtime against Jose Benavides Jr. and things are getting ugly right now Jamal things are really getting ugly first of all welcome back <laughs> all right of course so two and a half years it's been a long time. Are you ready for November 25th? I'm ready. Um, I got a chance to, you know, reshape everything and uh, get back to the roots of things. So I'm ready to show the world what I've been working on. All right. And so a lot of people have had a lot of controversy with you still having that WBC, that uh -huh. belt. You know, two and a half years, they're saying you've made excuses to hold on to the belt. They're even saying mental health, which is a real deal for everybody. What do you say to those people? You'll get a chance to see November 25th, what I've been working on, um, what my life consists of, and uh, me being the world champion that I am, I'll get a chance to defend that title soon. Yeah, unbeaten. You have never been beaten before. I saw the press conference kind of going down with you and Jose. There's a lot of smack talking going on, as boxing usually is. Is this fight any different from your other ones? Is this any more personal because it's a comeback? Well, I use it as fuel. Mm -hmm. You know, um, Benavidez, you know, uh, he has a lot to say so whenever we get in the ring he would have to make the best adjustments uh, to be someone like me so you know at the end of the day uh, you know boxing is my life and it's something I uh, put my life on the line for so we'll see once we get in there. Is there something that you did different? I know you were kind of trolling say I'm just getting into camp after you said you had been training that's kind of the, the smack talking kind of yeah. going on. Tell me about your team this time around. Um, one thing that I did um, this time around was I went back to the roots. Um, Free Fountain Jr. Uh, been training me since I was a kid. Ronnie Shields been training me since I was a kid. Uh, Danny Arnold has stepped back in the picture and um, he's pretty much been training me since 2010-11. So I pretty much got my old team back, you know, uh, and I'm going to go get the old team back. The, the fire is lit. So, you know, I got everything the, um, that I had starting off um, to end up having this great career. And we back to the roots. We've got less than two weeks. What changes here? You're at 163. You're fighting. You're not at 160. Are you comfortable at 163? Right now, I'm still a world champion at 160, so I still have some unfinished business mm -hmm. to take care of at 160. I'm, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling strong. I'm feeling fast. I'm feeling back. I'm back to normal. November the 25th on Showtime. We're going to put a link on our website. Coco Dominguez at the Roddy Shields Gym. Fox 26 News.